So how do I get to display settings? The first thing you want to do is do a right click on your desktop. I'm on my desktop right here. And I'm going to say display settings. So that's pretty easy. And then it's just going to pop up right here. Now, the only thing that I'm going to focus on today, we're going to focus on two things, resolution and the size of the text itself. So the text size is pretty easy. Let's say that I want to make it bigger. Now, look at the size of that event codes right there. We're going to put this right in the middle and let's go ahead and move this to 150%. We go to 150%. Now look, it's filling up almost the entire screen. And when we look at that icon now, look how much bigger that text is right there. So um, when you change the size of the text right here in scale and layout, there's nothing that says, hey, go back to the way it was. So you got to remember. But what's nice is it, it's still going to give you that recommended. So I'm going to go back to 100% recommended. Now notice it fits comfortably in there, but notice the text is smaller. So you can play with this however you feel um, you want your text to be displayed. Sometimes if you're having difficulty seeing the screen, sometimes we may just want to bump that up to 125 so that we can see the text a little bit bigger or um, we can go back to 100 and it won't be quite as large. All right, so that's pretty easy. These, um, then you have the other setting right here, which is the display resolution. Now, just like when we change the text size here, we have a recommended. And for this monitor, it's three, it's basically um, a 4K right wide monitor, 4,000 by 1,000. So, so here, what we want to do is um, always select the recommended. Now you may want to adjust that for whatever reason. And I can't show you in this video how to adjust it because as soon as I do it, I'm doing a screen shot of a video. I'm recording a video of my screen. It will automatically uh, stop recording and dork everything up. But to do it, you just select it just like we did here and it will change the screen. But the difference is that it's going to pop up a screen that says, would you like to keep this setting or revert back? Now it has a timer on it that will automatically revert you back. So for some reason you change your screen display into something you can no longer see, it's going to automatically pop back. I think it's 10 seconds, 10 or 15 seconds. You'd have to see. And then there's also a little button that says revert back. So don't worry too much about it. If you want to play with it, you can always revert it back.